Good morning, Wildcats. Today is March 26th, National Spinach Day. I'm Ashley. And I'm Morgan, reporting from room 218. Welcome to Fun Friday. and helping others? Do you want to pursue a career in health science or medicine? Then the Winter Park High School Athletic Training Program may be for you. In Miss Judy by today, you will be sent information for a team's meeting on Monday, March 29th. This is mandatory meeting and trials will start on April 1st. All seniors must order a final transcript after May 1st, 2021 to be sent to the college they plan to attend. Transcripts to all Florida public colleges and universities will be sent electronically. Transcripts to all other schools will be available for pickup in mid-June. Seniors will be responsible for picking up and mailing their final transcripts to any private or out-of-state colleges. Winter Park High School will not mail final transcripts to colleges. Hard copies of the official transcripts must not be opened by the student. They must remain sealed when delivered to the institution. Additionally, it is recommended that students order a physical copy to pick up at the school for their own records. Despite final transcripts being free of charge, seniors must place an order to receive a copy. Now let's hear from Stephen about some Fun Friday news. Thanks, Morgan. Recently, Jensen Carb contacted Cinnamon Toast Crunch on Twitter after claiming that he found shrimp tails in his cereal. After the cereal company examined the image, they claimed that it was an accumulation of cinnamon sugar due to the ingredients not being thoroughly blended, with no possibility of cross-contamination with shrimp. Still skeptical, Carp said it was clear that there were shrimp tails covered in cinnamon sugar. After digging deeper into the cereal bag, he found pieces of dental floss in the bag. Carp believes a rat got into the bag of cereal and nested there, which explains the collections of shrimp tails and string. Carp is going the distance and taking the tails to a lab to a DNA test and actually see if they're shrimp. Cinnamon Toast Crunch released a statement saying that none of this occurred at their facilities, and General Mills has yet to comment on the matter. So basically, that's gross. Check your cereal, and now back to Ashley for more announcements. Thanks, Steven. Placement auditions for the 2021 Sound of the Wildcats drumline and front assemble will take place Tuesday, May 11th in the main campus band room, room 630. Help clinics for the auditions will take place both face-to-face -face and virtually on Tuesday evenings between 6 and 8 p.m. leading up to the audition date to help students prepare audition materials. For more information, please contact Mr. Clemente at michaelclemente at ocps.net. Now let's go to Radio Jerry to hear about this week's Florida Man. What's up guys, it's Radio Jerry here with this week's Florida Man news. Today's Florida Man is none other than Mr. Swope, our very own chorus director. Nothing crazy, he just wants us to shout out our park singers. So Jake, would you like to give a statement? Yes, yes I would. Shout out to the park singers. Well said, my friend. Morgan, back to you. Thanks, Jerry. We're starting to wrap up March Madness after a pretty crazy month of college basketball. Here's Alex with more about that. Thanks, Morgan. This past weekend was the first two rounds of March Madness. It's been a great tournament so far with a record number of upsets with plenty of games still left to play. Brackets were busted as one seed Illinois, two seeds Ohio State and Iowa, and every three seed except Arkansas went home early. This is also the first tournament to not have any of the powerhouse programs of Duke, North Carolina, Kansas, or Kentucky make the second weekend since 1979. The Gonzaga Bulldogs are still the heavy favorite to win it all, but we can't forget the Cinderella teams like Oral Roberts and Oregon State. The Sweet 16 is on Saturday and Sunday, and if this round is anything like the first two, you won't want to miss it. Now back over to the anchors. Have a fantastic fun Friday, everyone.